Hi guys, um, I am back with a new puzzle and it will be an illegal cluster. Um, I recall an illegal cluster is an illegal position, but if you remove uh, any unit other than the kings, of course, then uh, the position becomes uh, legal. So in this puzzle, you have just uh, the black king and uh, white pawn, okay? And you need to add the white king, a white rook, and two white pawns to obtain an illegal cluster. So it means that after adding these uh, four units, if you remove um, one of the three white pawns or the white rook, then the position will be legal. You can pause the video and try to solve it. Okay, uh, let's see if you got the solution. First, I need to say that the, this puzzle is uh, strongly inspired from one created by uh, Radu Dragoescu in uh, 1982. So uh, let's see the solution. We want to build an illegal cluster, adding two white pawns, a white king and a white rook. So we could try something, you know, like... Uh, First, remember that you want an illegal position. So you, you could try something like this and say it's illegal because uh, it's not possible for the rook to come there. But for instance, this position is not illegal because the previous, uh, I don't know, the previous position could be this and you just play takes and uh, check. So first you need to build an illegal position. And of course it's, it's not over then you will need to have uh, an illegal cluster. So when you remove one of uh, these four units and any one of these four units, it the result will be a legal position. You could try something maybe like, uh, I don't know, something like this. This position is of course illegal because it's not possible for white to play something to have this check. Uh, but then if you remove, let's say this pawn, the position is still illegal, so this is not an illegal cluster. It's it, it's still not possible in this position for white to make a move and uh, administrate this check. So it's not working. So you need you need to find something. Uh, this time the position is clearly legal, so it, it it's not working. So you will have you you have to to find something, and it's not. It's not easy to, to obtain the, the illegal position. Maybe you can try this. Uh, then the position is clearly illegal. Uh, if you remove the rook, the position becomes legal. If you remove this, the position becomes legal because it could be just, uh, let's say the last move could be a rook uh, a8, take something in a to check. You could also remove the pawn in b2. Then the last move could be just a rook like this, check. So it's almost an illegal cluster, but the problem is this pawn. If you remove this pawn, the position is still illegal. What is the, la what is the last white move? You cannot find it because uh, it's not possible. So you have a pawn and you don't know what to do. If you build something like this, you, you still have a pawn since you need to add two pawns uh, with the white rook and the white king. So it's not working. So finally, let's go for the solution. Uh, the solution is this. So why this is working? Why this position is not legal? The idea is the fact that the king, the black king, is trapped in a1 but how the the black king could come in uh, a1 this will this will be the the, the key uh, question and you also have the the black king in check 
So you need to find a last move for uh, white. Okay. Uh, of course, the the rook can come from this row because it means that the black king would have been in check already. So there is only one possible white move: castle. If the last move of white is castle, then the result is a check. But then, if the last move is white castle, then how the black king reached this? It means that the black king never moved, and so it's not possible to come from here with the black king because uh, you have uh, two pawns that control uh, uh, a3 and b3, and it's not possible to come from there because the white king was here just one move ago. So this is why this position is illegal. If you remove the white rook, of course the position is legal. If you remove this pawn, of course the position is legal because the last move could be just uh, rook f1 check. And if you remove one of these two pawns, then the last move can be castle. Because after uh, castle check, it was possible for the black king to arrive in a1 if this pawn was missing. He could just uh, come there. And if this pawn was missing, it's the same. It, it, it could come from here. And so one possible option was this, like, uh, let's say that this piece uh, didn't move. So you, 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 you can try to, to build uh, the position. If you have, uh, let's say, uh, this, you can imagine that you have a piece, uh, I don't know, like this. You can imagine that black is like this, uh, okay. And check. Okay, so this is a legal position. It is absolutely the same if uh, you remove uh, this pawn instead of this one. So well, this was the this was the solution. Uh, putting uh, the piece like this, you have an illegal position, which becomes legal if you remove one of the four units, one of the three pawns, or the white rook. Well, uh, tell me in the comments if you if you had it. Bye-bye, guys, and see you for another puzzle really soon. Ciao.